And uh, when you say you're in the love business, I'm just curious, you, you're on a lot of boards and I imagine you go to a lot of board meetings, so do you sit down around the board table and say, hey, how are, we gonna <laughs> love you. how are we going to share the love or spread the love? My, my interpretation of that is I, I like to tune into where I am and attempt to speak and share in a way accessible and receivable by where I am. I'm more interested in how to actually reach everybody mm -hmm. than to prove, you know, mm -hmm. make them think my way or something mm -hmm. like that. So, back, that, back to the sacred and the profane. Mm -hmm. If you go into the profane world and you simply speak the pure truth, mm -hmm. well, that's one path, and it, and it does have, and it's a, a good one for those who can, who can sustain it. Uh, I think our need is urgent, and I want to attract people. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so, here would be an example in the boardroom. There are some boards that I'm on that do reflective practice to begin the board meeting. Mm -hmm. They have a mindfulness bill. Uh, those are rare, but they exist and I get to participate in it. Maybe they sing uh, to, in order to be out of the mind and into in something shared and breathing together and that kind of thing. However, most of the business boards uh, I never consider that I'm the smartest business person or the smartest finance person in the room, but I often am valuable where the emotional, spiritual, psychological hits the pragmatic. So you, you can, I, I, I can be in a board meeting where all of a sudden <clears throat> it feels very locker room mm -hmm. and it's kind of a bunch of egos flaring up mm -hmm. and just I don't like you, I don't like what you, you know, I'm trying to win my point, and it can get, and I may end up being a peacemaker, mm -hmm. uh, helping diffuse mm -hmm. that kind of thing and bring in some, some other perspectives or speak privately with the individuals and help you know, bring it to them. Effectively, what I think I'm doing is bringing love back into the equation, and I, see, we can have disagreements and still feel love. So, that, so that's kind of a range. There are boards that actually do practices together and acknowledge. Mm -hmm. Hollyhock would be one of those. I mean, we think that we are a trust, love, and competence manufacturing facility. Mm -hmm. And we offer teachers and programs and conferences and things like that. But really what we're doing is adding to the possibility and, and offering experiential unspoken Immersion in more self-loving, therefore more external loving kinds of behavior and, and sensibility.